open its products. Today we are going to see the topic which you get with here. This one is this one is very easy. This is which you get with here similar to right method. Now we are going to see the definition of which you get with here. Okay. Let me see the statement here. A system of linear equations written in the matrix form of as A is equal to B. A is consistent if and only if the rank of the coefficient matrix is equal to the rank of augmented matrix. That is, rank of A is equal to rank of A by B. This is as rank of A is equal to rank of A by B, A by B is called as which can be there. So consider three linear equations. Now x plus 2y plus 3 is that is equal to 2 and 4x plus 5y plus 6 is that equal to 2. x plus y plus is that equal to 3. I have consider three linear equations and this equation write in the form of A x is equal to B. Now, this a, a matrix is nothing but the coefficient of x, y, z. So, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 1, 1, that one way I return here. The next x, y, z, that is unknowns. And 2, 2, 3, that is the constant values, that is nothing but b matrix. This is in the form of a, x is equal to b. Now, a is equal to 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 1, 1. Here. Count the number of non zeros here. How many numbers are there? How many numbers are there? Three numbers are there. Three numbers. This is one non zero. This is another non zero. This is another one. Totally three non zeros is there. So it has three non zero rows. So rank of A is equal to three. Now, augmented matrix C. Augmented matrix A by B is equal to slug. A by B is nothing but I write A matrix and B matrix combined. B. So now A by B is equal to 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 1, 1. And B matrix 2, 2, 3. So now here, here also 3 non zeros. This is also non zero, 1 non zero, this is another non zero, this is another non zero. Totally we have 3 non zeros in this there. So, rank of A by B is equal to 3. See here, rank of A is equal to 3 and rank of A by B is equal to also 3. This is called Ritchie Capri theorem. So, this is that is called Ritchie Capri theorem. Rank of, A by, rank of A is equal to rank of A by B. So, now next, we are going to see some rules for this Ritchie Capri theorem. See here, by Ruchi Kepi theorem, we have the following rules. Three rules are, are there. So, rule number one if rank of A is equal to rank of A cannot be, then number of rules are equal. So, these three are equal, then the system is what? Consistent and it has unique solution. The next one, so see here rank of A is equal to three, and rank of A cannot be is also three. Number of, number of rules 3. This 3 must be equal, then only this rules is applicable. The system is consistent with the single solution. Suppose, suppose rule number 2. Suppose if rank of A and rank of A be equal to same value and announce is less than number of rules. So suppose rank of A equal to 2 and rank of A equal to 2, but number of rules 3. X, Y, Z. So, in this case, the system is what? Consistent. It has infinitely many solutions. Next, rule number 3. If rank of A value and rank of A comma B value not equal, then the system is inconsistent. It, is, it has no solution. So, rank of A value 2 and rank of A B value 3. Or rank of A is equal to 1 and rank of A comma B equal to 2. But both are not equal. Therefore, it has the system is inconsistent, it has no solution. These three rules is very very important for to solve this exercise. Okay, next. 
Now we are going to see the problem exercise 1.6. The first exercise 1.6, first problem, test for consistency and if possible solve the following system of equations by right method. So here three linear equations x minus y plus 2 is at equal to 2 and 2x plus y plus 4 is at equal to 7. 4x minus y plus is at equal to 4. First step, Ruchi Kapitera, first step in the three linear equation we can write in the form of ax is equal to b. So now let me take the five equation here matrix A and x, y, z unknowns and a constant value B matrix. Okay. So first here how many number of unknowns? Three unknowns like x, y, z. So now augmented matrix A matrix, B matrix and it is joint union. That is called augmented matrices. So 1 minus 1, 2, 2, 1, 4, 4 minus 1, 1 and B matrix 2, 7, 4. Already we know that right method to find first row, first element must be 1. After second row, first element must be 0. After third row, first element and second element must be 0. That is called in the form of Eklon form. So here first row, first element is 1 and second row, first element is 2 and third row, first element is 4. I am making to change the 2, 0 and I am making change to this 4 equal to 0 and another I am making to change minus 1 equal to 0. So I am for that I am using this operation R2 tends to R2 minus 2 R1. If you look at this, R2 is the term of 0 and R2 is the term of 0 and R2 is the term of 2 minus 2 will get 0. That is, I am using this operation. So the same way, R3 tends to R3. Here, 4. So I am multiplying minus 4 into R1. So we will get this, uh, this element become 0. Okay. This operation high written here. R2 tends to R2 minus 2 R1. R2 value 2, 1, 4, 7. Minus 2 R1, minus 2. Minus, minus 2 into minus 1, plus 2. Minus 2 into 2, minus 4. Minus 2 into 2, minus 4. Add this. 2 minus 2, 0. 1 plus 2, 3. 3 4 minus 4, 0. 7 minus 4, 3. Okay. Now, writing this, this operation. R3 tends to R3 minus 4. R3 value I written here. R3, 4, minus 1, 1, 4. And minus 4 R1. So minus 4 into R1. Minus 4, minus 4 into minus 1, plus 4, minus 4 into 2, minus 8, minus 4 into 2, minus 8. So add this, 4 minus 4, 0, minus 1, plus 4, 3, 1, minus 8, minus 7, 4, minus 8, minus 4. This value I written here. 0, 3, 0, 3, 0, 3, minus 7, minus so now here first row first element 1 and the second row first element 0 and third row first element is also 0. But we have to 0 in the second element in third row. Okay. So we can use this operation. So now we had this uh, subtract to an R3 and R2. We will get this element become 0. So I use. So now. I use this operation R3, R3 tends to R3 tends to R3 minus R2. So R3 value 0, 3, minus 7, minus 2. And R, R minus R2 value minus 0, sorry, minus 3, 0, minus 3. So now we add this 0 plus 0, 0, 3 minus 3, 0, minus 7 plus 0, minus 7, minus 4, minus 3, minus 7. This value I return here. So now see here. This is in the form of Eklund form. So now we are going to uh, find out the rank. So first day, is it really a element of the A matrix? Is it a rendered set of the B matrix? A B matrix. So that is the rank of A solution. Is it how many answers is there? This is uh, one answer. This is one answer. Here also one answer. Is any one of the element must be non zero that row is that uh, the row is also non zero rows so here one non zero this next another non zero this is another non zero so totally we have three non zero so rank of a is equal to three 
Next, the rate of wake on the beach is also part of the water. So, here is one half to the water. This is also one half to the water. This is also one half to the water. So, rate of wake on the beach is equal to 3. Suppose, in the term of 0, it is not. Suppose, in the term of 0, it is not. Rate of pay value is not. 0 and 0. 0 and 0. The most of it is 0 and 0. It is 0. So, total of we have two matters. But the part of the equal part of the day, this is not zero, this is also not zero, this is also not zero. So, totally we have three non zero. So, rank of eight three, rank of eight one B, so that is also three. So, rank of eight is equal to and rank of eight one B is equal to three. Already we have number of nodes also three. So, total all are, all are equal, therefore the system is what consistent, it has unique solution. So, in the form of the number of nodes, in the last consecutive matrix, we have to be help to write in the equation. Equation form. So 1 minus 1, 2, 2. We can write in the form of equation x minus y plus 2 is at equal to 2. The next one, 3y is equal to 3. And the next one, 7 is at equal to minus 7. I written here. So next from 3 to third equation. Minus 7 is at equal to minus 7. And this is at equal to what? Minus 7 by minus 7. That is x is at equal to 1. So now second equation will take second equation 3y is equal to what? 3. 3y is equal to 3 and y is equal to what? 3 by 3. Y is equal to 1. We know that already well, already z value 1 and y value 1. We substitute in the equation of 1. So already we know that it's equation 1 x minus y plus 2 is equal to 2. We have substitute y value and z value. So x minus y, y value 1 plus 2 into z value 1 is equal to 2 x minus 1 plus 2 equal to 2. So x 2 minus 1 1 plus 1. So x plus 1 is equal to 2. That x is equal to what? 2. That 1 becomes that side. 2 minus 1 which is equal to what? 1. So I mean, x value 1, y, y value 1, z value 1. These three values I am substituting any one of the equation. It will so x minus y plus 2 is equal to 2. So the more value I will equal to equal to that. So, y is value 1, y value 1, 2 into z value 1 is equal to 2. 1, 1 get cancelled, 2 is equal to 2. So, 1, 1 is equal to 2. Okay.